I think it's very significant uh, that it is a woman who is the first to discover the tomb empty and then see the risen Jesus. And of course, that's Mary Magdalene. Of all people, it's, it's Mary. And uh, with her own somewhat dubious background. What, why I think that is significant is it tells me that the gospel writers are telling the truth. If you're gonna make up a story, if you're gonna to try to help the story, improve the story, that's a funny way of doing it. Why not have Peter, I'll have all 11 of the surviving apostles show up. Why not have Pilate show up and, and say, oh, I, boy, did I make a mistake. Or why not have Caiaphas and some of the Sanhedrin show up? But the gospel writers don't do that. They are restrained by what happened. And so whether you like it or not, whether it's the best apologetic or not, and in this case, it isn't, they have the women show up first. But why? Because that's what happened.